city does not want the story to be the trouble that happened during the Super Bowl. They want everything to run smoothly. Also here, Josh Chapin is at Discovery Green. Let's join him now with his part of the story. This is 13 football fields worth of space, and we sort of wanted to give you a lay of the land here downtown, what you should expect in terms of getting around. We're going to start over here by the GRB. This is where the NFL experience is, and then just a three-minute walk, and we got ourselves right over to the Marriott Marquis. That is the NFL's headquarters, sort of ground zero for the NFL for Super Bowl 51. A short walk, and we are right back in the middle of Discovery Green, the 12-acre park that uh, you'll be able to see the massive Fox Sports studio set as well as the NASA-inspired future, future flight that's part of the wow factor for Super Bowl Live. Now, another three-minute walk, and you're fully immersed in Super Bowl Live. You're going to have four stages. One stage will have local Houston artists, two NFL activations. Three is going to be the main stage. You're going to see someone like ZZ Top there. Four is going to be more community inspired events and we cannot forget of course about the Toyota Center which is just another couple minute walk across the street that has three Rockets games the week of the Super Bowl as well as an MMA fight the night before. Now in all that took us about 11 minutes we walked at a pretty rapid pace but of course that does not account as Josh Marshall was talking about for the crowds for all the traffic going on around here the NFL and the host committee tells us they are so thankful that all of these things all the attractions you see right around me are so close together Len I'll send it back to you all right Josh thank you very much so